Hello and welcome back. My name is Amulli and you are watching Tube Mint. In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Node.js, NPM and Yarn. So let's get started. So go ahead and open your browser. I am going to use Google Chrome and then go to nodejs.org and whenever you land on this page, you will always have two versions of Node.js. The, the one here on the left is going to be the LTS release and this is going to be the current release with latest features okay so no matter which one you're going to install you, I had never any issue with the current one but it's recommended to use the LTS release so let's go ahead and download the LTS 12.13 and I'm going to save it on my desktop you can change the location from here so select the desktop and save it yeah so 12.13.1 LTS and this 13.20 was just released a few days ago and it's on November the 23rd and as you can see the MSI package node package is almost done downloading so let's go ahead and run it because it's on my desktop so I'll go to desktop and locate this node.js MSI package and I'm going to run it so to run it you've got two options you can right click on it and hit install or you simply double click on it and this is going to start the installation process here we are if you get something like this smart screen can't be reached right now you simply have to say run then you have to say next but accept the terms in the license agreement this is where your node.js is going to be installed if you want to change you can change it otherwise next so it's already going to install npm and also going to add this node.js to the path okay so so that you can execute it from anywhere do not make any changes over here and then hit next chocolatey uh, we do not know note that this will also install chocolate to the script okay so I don't want to get chocolate okay go ahead and hit next that's a very big package so that's going to take huge time long time and then just wait for it and here we are node is almost installed here okay so you can see completed the node JS setup wizard go ahead and hit finish now let's go ahead and launch the terminal it's basically command prompt and then say node and node bad option version <laughs> okay so this must be like that so you can see i've got 12.13.1 this also works now you can go ahead and run it and watch that okay so it's working perfectly fine now let's go ahead and exit I don't know control C so you have to say control C again to exit so you have to to exit control press or D or type exit so okay let's try this you simply have to type exit like that okay and then we already have npm installed with it so let's go ahead and check so i've got npm 6.1 2.1 but we also need the yarn package so let's go ahead and install yarn pkg and this takes you to yarnpkg.com you can go ahead and google it or you simply type yarnpkg.com here you simply have to install 
so this has already detected your operating system type and this has this is only 32 bit okay this is going to be the stable and this is the 90 so always go with stable go ahead and download the MSI release for Windows if you got chocolate installed please hold on these instructions so choco install yarn you can see yarn has been downloaded so go ahead and just exit and here we have yarn just double click on it it's going to be the same process but you may get something like this which says it's it's Microsoft Windows security feature so simply have to say install anyway still is taking bit time here now go ahead and hit install anyway then say next accept the license agreement and this is where it's going to be installed so it's 32 bit it's not 64 bit and hit yes it's been installed now let's go ahead and check yarn 1.19.1 so we've got node.js npm and yarn so that's how you download and install node.js and yarn and npm comes with node so you don't have to do install it separately however if you want to upgrade npm you simply say npm like g global i npm and this is going to upgrade the npm node.js package manager and this may take some time here okay so you can see npm is just upgraded it added few packages and it took almost 30 seconds so it's always recommended whenever you install node.js go ahead and upgrade npm okay so that's it for this video thank you so much for watching this video please like share and subscribe to my channel have a good day bye for now